I started this idea for the exhibition of the fourth state of water when I realized that I'm like a drop in this huge ocean of people from all different disciplines, poets, scientists, philosophers, artists, environmentalists, all working with water, not to mention the religious rituals and all the pollution and all the world that's now in so much trouble is what really concerned me. But I wanted to show all the good work people are doing, and especially the role artists are playing in raising consciousness about the issues of water. So the overarching theme for me was the fourth state of water. And the idea there is that it's not what we usually think of in terms of water being liquid or vapor or ice, but a fourth in-between state. And this became a metaphor to me for a different consciousness, a shift in paradigm and the water of life being a reflection of that consciousness that we carry. Torren is the place where we launched this idea, the place, the birthplace of Copernicus. It seems appropriate. And when I was choosing artists, I was looking for Japan and Japanese artists to be the epicenter because of Fukushima. And the reason is that this is probably the biggest danger that we're facing now in the world. So now we're ready to launch the symposium on World Water Day, and you're joining me and all the people all around the world who are looking at water. We're all drops, and we're all really important and really insignificant. I give you the gift of water. <laughs>